In the beginning, it was he was running. We started from our side actually. Yes, yeah. you wouldn't come inside the building. No, we started from the car. He wouldn't get up the car. So um, it started from the car and then he come out of the car eventually, gradually. And then it was outside, from outside to the corridor, mm -hmm. and from the corridor inside. And now sitting, he wouldn't be doing that. He would be running off. <laughs> oh, we have a big squeeze. And then we sit away in the store. And yeah, it has changed him a lot, a lot. And the team are amazing, so patient. And it has given me respite as well, you know, because when he's at the flute theatre, I can just sit and watch him and not feel, you know, bad leaving him. And I'm there watching. And it has changed him amazingly, a great deal. And it, um, I would, you know, the consistency as well, because it's always consistent. And, you know, for someone like my son, they need that consistency. The timing, the date, you know, when he's coming, he knows, and it's all, you know, consistent. And that's really important for children like my son. Yeah. learned from him that having that consistency and patience and you know and you know gradually you know you see little lights little things little changes and that little changes money little changes become expanded so not to ignore that tiny dot of light and that will become bigger and bigger and bigger <laughs> I know I keep saying I wouldn't be sitting here uh, if it wasn't that patience and, and, and that consistency with my son because he used to be a runner all the time, all the time and to be, you know, uh, I know I'm talking next to him uh, for which I <laughs> it's important to say that, you know, he used to kick, he used to bite, he used to um, run and, and pick everything and now like he's calm, patient, let's now sit down and uh, you know this is because of the little tiny changes expanded to a bigger one and the consistency as well and and you know Wonderful. and I think it's important to see that little light on the tunnel. And I say one piece for me. And Yoni says, Under my arms, under my arms, under my arms. Oh, I find it really difficult to express how much I'm grateful and I'm thanking to you guys. It's it's so difficult to well, to express it, and I'm so thankful honestly and for that's why I consistently come and you know you guys made these changes to my side.
it's uh, like a, a family yeah. to me and to our kids. And I feel so welcomed and I feel free. And, you know, I'm not just focus on my son, you are capable when I did, you know, and you know, friendly, smiling, and you know, I feel like I'm, I'm at home.